I am the lab supervisor and um, the emergency preparedness coordinator for Douglas County Memorial Hospital in Armour. I started off at this hospital at Douglas County Memorial Hospital. It was my first job. They um, were the first ones to give me a chance um, probably over 20 years ago and I've been here ever since. I really enjoy science. Using that to help patients just seemed like a good fit for me. I kind of like that behind the scenes uh, sort of detective work and, and giving out information and results to the providers to help the patients. I grew up in Nebraska, uh, went to college in uh, Yankton at Mount Marty, and then did some clinicals in Des Moines. I like to see the patients that I serve at church and at the grocery store and at the post office. And um, you just get a sense that they trust you. They, they see you often, you see them, you want to do good by them. Um, I seem to be the go-to person for research kind of questions, you know, the Hey Heather, I've got a patient with um, XYZ diagnosis or symptoms. Can you, and I'm kind of looking at this particular illness or this particular condition. What should I order? Can you help me figure out what tests would give me give me the best information to kind of move this patient forward and, and help us form a treatment plan? So I really like that that research part of it. For the lab, we, you know, had to bring in COVID testing in-house, which was kind of a long process. It was very difficult when we were testing patients daily and trying to make sure that those samples would get to Sioux Falls on a timely basis. And if they weren't, we were having staff drive them. For the emergency preparedness aspect, you know, it was an extremely difficult year. You know, you train and you drill for all types of different emergencies and, you just don't think that a pandemic, you cross your fingers, you know, for your whole career and you just hope that you won't have to deal with that. And sure enough, we did. And and you, you talk through those things and you you learn those things and you try to teach your team how to, to deal with those things, but you truly don't know, you don't know what you don't know. It's been difficult. You think back over that time and it's, it's hard. I, I wouldn't want to do it again. You know, we've always known that we do important work and um, to be recognized for that is, is very humbling. I think it's important to remember that it's not just the patient care staff that, that make a, a difference in those patients' lives. It's, it's the maintenance crew, it's the housekeeping ladies, it's the, um, the billing and the office ladies. It, it, it's a whole team effort. Mm -hmm.